The role of unmanned military aircraft vehicles are growing at an unprecedented rate and they're rapidly transforming the way wars are fought across the globe. Drone warfare is extremely prevalent in today's world as it allows militaries to completely remove the chance for loss of life from reconnaissance missions and engagements. Please don't forget to subscribe and I hope you enjoy the video. At number 10, the Elbit Hermes 900. Elbit Hermes 900 is an Israeli medium-sized, multi-payload, medium-altitude, long-endurance, unmanned aerial vehicle designed for tactical missions. It is intended for intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance as it does not carry any armor. The Hermes 900's first operational mission took place in 2014, which was the link in a chain of operations that eventually led to a fighter jet attack that destroyed terrorist infrastructure. It's powered with a single Rotax 914 turbo aircraft engine, producing 115 horsepower. At number nine, the CH-5 Rainbow. The CH-5 Rainbow is from the series of Chinese-developed unmanned aerial vehicles. The CH-5 Rainbow conducted its maiden flight in 2015 and is equipped to carry munitions of various types. It is the latest unmanned combat aerial vehicle in the Rainbow series and can carry a maximum of 16 missiles at a single time. It is powered by a single turbocharged conventional engine producing about 450 horsepower. At number 8, the General Atomics MQ-1C Grey Eagle drone. The General Atomics MQ-1C Grey Eagle is also called Sky Warrior and first came into service in 2009. It is a medium altitude, long endurance, unmanned aircraft developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the US Army. It can be armed with four Hellfire missiles or eight Stinger missiles and four Viper strike bombs. It is powered with a Centurion 1.7 heavy fuel engine which produces about 165 horsepower. At number seven, the Thai Anker. The Thai Anker is developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries for the requirements of the Turkish Armed Forces and put into service in 2013. The vehicle is designed to perform in adverse weather conditions, providing real-time image intelligence, surveillance and tracking missions. The vehicle is powered with a single TUSAS Engine Industries PD-170 engine, which produces an output of 155 horsepower. At number 6, the Dassault Neuron. This is an experimental drone still under development and was first flown in 2012. It is being built by a collaboration of international corporations led by the French company Dassault Aviation. The Neuron can be controlled from a ground base station or from controlled stations on combat aircraft such as the French Rafale or the Swedish Griffin. This aerial vehicle is expected to have an endurance of several hours and believed to have an armament payload of 2,230 kilogram guided bombs. At number five, the MQ-9 Reaper. This UCAV is capable of remotely controlled or autonomous flight operations and was developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems primarily for the United States Air Force. The MQ-9 Reaper, sometimes called Predator B, is the first hunter-killer designed for long endurance, high altitude surveillance. It is armed with up to four Hellfire air-to-ground missiles and two 230kg Paveway 2 laser-guided bombs. It is powered with a single Honeywell turbofan engine which produces an output of 900 horsepower. At number four, the Boeing X-45. 
The Boeing X-45 was first flown in 2002 as a concept demonstrator for the next generation of the completely autonomous military aircraft. The X-45 is armed with a two-weapon bay, making it able to carry combination joint direct attack ammunition and small diameter bombs. However, only two of the 45s were ever built, as Boeing ended up losing the US Army and Navy contract to Northrop, costing the company $1.2 billion. At number three, the General Atomics Avenger, also known as the Predator C. This drone was first built in 2009 by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the US military. The Avenger is powered by a Pratt & Whitney Canadian turbofan engine with an S-shaped exhaust for reduced infrared and radar signatures. The Avenger's design includes stealth features such as internal weapon storage which has a 1,600 kg payload capacity. The UCAVs also has six external hardpoints, which can include several guided bombs and AGM-114 Hellfire missiles. At number two, the Northrop Grumman RQ-4 Global Hawk. The RQ-4 Hawk was first developed in 1998 and is operated by the United States Air Force. It is used for reconnaissance and intelligence collection only, as it has no weapons bay. It uses high-resolution synthetic aperture radar and long-range infrared sensors, allowing for long loiter times over target areas at a safer distance. It can survey as much as 40,000 square miles of terrain a day, an area the size of South Korea or Iceland. At number one the Northrop Grumman X-47B. The X-47B was developed by the American defense technology company Northrop Grumman and first flew in 2011. This UCAV has made top spot on the list because it was the pioneer in the military drone sector as it demonstrated new technologies like autonomous aerial refueling and carrier-based takeoff and landings. The X-47 has a very high top speed for a drone and it is armed with two weapon bays providing for up to 2,000 kilograms of ordnance. So that is the top 10 military drones in the world. Please subscribe for similar content and thanks for watching.